so good. Have a sit down. Oh my God. I love you too. Okay. See, I love you too. I love you too. It's so interesting. This this show today is perfect because I'm looking around our audience and I'm seeing what y'all are wearing because the weather is warming up. I see you in your bandeau summer top. I see you in summer tops, mini skirts. Cause it's that time of the year we start like shedding winter, all those things. And it's interesting because, oh boy, how do I start this show? For some reason in my timeline on social media, BBLs for men. <laughs> I don't know what algorithm I'm in, but it's a lot of like men conversations because they always talk about women and what we're doing, right? It's a lot about that in my, in my timeline with BBLs and men. Okay, so I'll explain if you don't know what a BBL is. But meanwhile, they say in 2022, cosmetic procedures. Folks are gonna spend around $11.8 billion. That's a lot of money. And so whether they're looking for things to get bigger, smaller, tighter, brighter. <laughs> Doctors are giving you what you want. I always say in this show, it's a judgment-free zone because I feel like if you want it and there's a doctor who can safely do it, do you, do you, do you. That's my theory, right? So today, it's fascinating because my producers have put together a show of people who are at the top of the game and they are literally giving people what they want in the latest cosmetic trends. For example, they say you can get a six pack without ever doing a single crunch, <laughs> a leg lift, BBLs, all these things, right? I keep saying BBL, they're gonna censor me at some point. <laughs> well, our first guest, she is absolutely fascinating. Her name is Dr. Sharon Giese. She's a board certified plastic <laughs> surgeon who gives celebrity clients like our friend Food God and Real Housewives alum Sonia Morgan what they want, right? I like her as our first guest because she does something called psychosurgery. And she's even gonna show us some of the latest procedures here in the show. This is the first time we've really done a show like this, but because it keeps popping up in my timeline, I was like, let's dig into some of these things that are out there. Tam fam, please welcome Dr. Sharon Giese to our studio. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for you. $11 billion spent on procedures. That is a lot of people going in and saying, doctor, this is what I want. And folks like you at the top of the game able to provide that. I said BBL 100 times at the top of the show. <laughs> that sounds good. <laughs> that just Rolling sounds great. Your it just sounds good. Okay, so you don't do that procedure per se because it's, it's, you said it's a high complication rate with it. It's a, it is. Um, I've been a surgeon for a long time and I do a lot of breast surgery and face surgery right. and others that, you know, that makes me happy. It's a lower right. complication. It's a lower, com but, but the transfer of fat is not new, but the technology and advancement from moving things to places where we don't want to where we're okay with it. Right, which is great. I mean, I call that kind of borrowing. I just recycle borrow it. Borrowing, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I need to borrow some from here. Yeah, exactly. Right. We, and then you just transfer it out. So the complication rates in the BBL per, per what you believe is high, but for the other areas. It does, hasn't borne out in the research. So, wow. you know, I, I do, like I said, a lot in the face. We'll do the breasts. You know, those are really happy areas. Happy. People have little dents, not, yeah. you know, making something Big transformation. that wasn't there. So mm -hmm. you, you do something very interesting because you train classical piano, uh, painting, and, and that plays a major role in how you go about transforming bodies. Because our bodies are a work of art. We come out this way. God gave us our bodies. but. Yeah. Anything can be tweaked a bit. Well, it, it is, and it's and it is artistic. Yeah. And I think that when you open, you hit on something called psychosurgery. What is what psychosurgery? It, it's really figuring out what's going to make someone happy. Oh, it's like what does someone want? And people don't always really know what they want. And so that's really the first part of my job is trying to figure that out. I don't want to put my aesthetic on someone else, yeah. but I want to give them what they want and what they perceive. Okay, so that's why this show is called Giving People What They Want. Okay, so we've been noticing a rise in people being open and honest about surgery. Shark Tank Barbara Corcoran recently told uh, a paper that she's had three facelifts and wants a fourth for her 85th birthday. She's been very, very open and honest. People are evolving in the conversation. So I wanna jump into some of the things that you do. Do you offer a lace invasive procedure that transforms someone's appearance? Um, it's called a natural lift. What's a natural lift? Because this is a before and after. 
the natural. I knew you'd say that. <laughs> That's why I was like, get to the pictures, people. You know, All right. It's, it's um, removing just a little bit of fat from the neck and from the jowl area. And those are things that really make people um, show their age, but also for the younger group, they can have a double chin. And these are real pictures mm -hmm. provided, but what are you doing in this? So there's a little tool that I use, internal ultrasound, that has a little bit of heat and it kind of melts the fat. And then I just remove a very small amount of fat. And it's non, is it invasive? Minimally invasive. So it go, you go, you can show me, because I have it. Go ahead. Oh, <laughs> I don't, oh, very, God. very little. Oh, right you didn't say none. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing I don't have an ego, dang. Okay, so now we know who's going for the summer surgery. Go ahead. So oh, there's no knife. I've never subjected little... myself to this. I'm okay, sorry. that's okay. I've got something. Go so ahead. it's just with a little needle here and behind the ears, and so you don't see anything. What's my recovery time? I mean, I'm getting. What's my? <laughs> what, what's a person's recovery time. time? I do these usually on Thursdays and Friday, and people go back to work on Monday. Oh, it's funny because we don't tape on Fridays. Oh, Perfect. There you go. Okay. All right. For people who want the defined abs, okay, not all of these are your patients. Now, tell me what's happened here. So there's a device that does muscle toning, and you, we'll see a demonstration later, but it's just a paddle, and it's contracting the muscle, and it will go up to 10,000 times in a half an hour. So it really is nice if people want to get toned and show more muscle definition. What is that doing to my body? I mean, like, so I, I the, per, the patient, Okay. Lies down, uh -huh. and then you put the machine on. We're going to show this on our show, by the way, because I've never seen it in person. And it simulates uh, crunches? It simulates similar, because you're toning the muscle. And so if it's simulating the muscle 10,000 times in a half half an hour, that's like doing a lot of sit-ups. So my patients really you, use it. Because when I do a lot of sit-ups, the next day I'm sore. Is you, you're this, is a little sore? sore. You're sore after this. You get this. a little bit sore. But I usually will do four sessions for a patient. They can do twice a week oh. to yeah, kind of get beach ready. And remind quickly. me how long the session is again? 30 minutes. 30 minute session. 30 minutes, and you walk out. There's no downtime with this one. I have a lot of people who do it during their lunch hour. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Everyone's looking at their calendar. <laughs> Siri, what do I <laughs> Okay, for people who want to lose fat but don't want to take the surgical route with liposuction, there's a device that you use. It's a red light therapy, and you say uh, some people lose four inches in their first session. In the first... So this is it. So we have some before and after pictures. Mm -hmm. Can we show it, guys? The first 32-minute session. Oh, um, I see that. And if she had what I call, it's almost like a waist buster because the, um, it really simulates what liposuction does because it will treat all the way around. Typical areas are belly, muffin top area. So you can decrease the size of your waist, even a little bit on the medial thighs. You said muffin top, and I'm looking over here. <laughs> like so how long does this take, this particular? This, it's also 30 minutes session, 30 minutes, 32 30 minutes. minutes. So session. on average, what does something like that cost? Because I have to be real with my audience and people watching at home, because insurance does not cover that. I wish they did. I'd be like, don't. here's my insurance card. So what is first it? time I like to sell it for a package is $3,000, so it's $500 of treatment. So after someone completes a series of six, they can come in for one or two. Touch-ups. Touch-ups on occasion, get ready for the beach. I've gotten you hooked, I know, right? <laughs>